Um, again, just can't say enough how proud I am of this group, uh, the way they came out from the beginning of the game and just competed and, and they really uh, made a statement on the defensive end and that's what we talked about um, and they knew going into this game that we had to be great defensively and rebounding wise and, and they were. And then these two um, to my left and right were just complete just warriors on both ends of the floor attacking like crazy um, and, and just carrying on our, our team in a lot of ways and I'm just super proud of them and, and our entire team. Questions. Coach, the way you guys started the game, 14-5 run, started the second half, 11-0 run, when your team's clicking like that and goes on runs, scoring at will and, and hitting threes, yeah. what's that like to just watch and, <laughs> so and see them score? I have the best seat in the house. I love it. I just love it. No, it just, it makes me so happy for them because it's the way that they do it. You know, it's it's not just the fact that, yeah, we're, we're scoring and um, it's it's the way they do it. It's the way they, they get amazing stops against a really good team and then are able to convert on the other end and, and the way they play together. Um, I'm just, I'm so happy for them because, you know, they're the ones that have put in the work. They're the ones doing it. Um, and, and I love to see them reap the, the rewards of it. Coach, you talked yesterday just about the response after a loss, mm -hmm. how it would be. Yep. I think it's safe to say that they uh, they responded yep. pretty well yep. tonight. That's, I mean, it's the DNA of this team. Uh, again, like that's, Exactly. I was I was curious to see. I, I had all the faith in the world in them because um, that's what they've done every single time. I didn't know they respond this well. I mean, my goodness, um, no. But I, it, it is what they do when there's when we have a down moment, when we face adversity, um, they come back stronger and I'm just again just proud of who they are. Tanaya, I know a, a rare setback for you in the the last game uh, at Boston College. I'm, I'm sure mentally you're kind of ready to get right back out there quickly. I guess how much how nice was it to respond so well for you personally um, after that game? I feel like after I mean after that game, I feel like I was a little out of whack, so I just tried to come out here in attack mode. But I really wasn't worried about it. I just you know it was a reset button for me and the team. Um, we just had to focus on the details, and I feel like we did we did that. Sarah, what's been working for you recently? 26 and now 21 and the, the buzzer beater as well. What, what was that like and what do you think has been working for you? Yeah, um, I just had to overcome kind of that um, negative mindset of me when I couldn't hit shots. So I just went up there and I had my coaching staff that like kept on telling me to, yeah, reassuring me that I knew what to do. So. <laughs> Once I had that one game, it just felt good this game, and hopefully I'll carry on the whole season with this. Y'all see your reassurance. Brooke, I think Tanaya uh, broke the program record. I think it was her yeah, sixth 30 else. point game. Yes, yeah, the Natasha gosh. Howard record. What can you say about her that you hasn't, I mean, hasn't been said already? I don't know. Um, there's, I mean, what, gosh, there's so much to say. Just. Again, I'm just so proud of, of her mentality. And like you, like we just talked about, like to bounce back. For a freshman to have the consistency that she does mentally, um, I, I've never seen anything like it. And to carry the load of, you know, being our the starting point of our offense to, that's a lot for any player. Um, and again, for a freshman to do that and do it at, at so consistently. Um, so yes, I'm, I'm so happy for her. She puts in the work, she handles it so beautifully. Um, and yeah, just a freshman. I think the, all the players that have gotten those five, the, the record before were seniors or something. I mean, Suko Cantus and Natasha Howard were seniors yeah. when they have that. Yeah, so, the single looking season forward to record. a lot of, a lot more of those. Period, period, period. Tonight, I think, uh, I think it may have been the second quarter where you had a block and <laughs> yeah, you were losing your mind. Your yeah. teammates were, were mauling you. And it just seems like you really. <laughs> I mean, we see what you do on offense, but mm -hmm. on defense, it seems like you really take pride in that. What, what, what do you? What's kind of your mindset defensively, and how exciting was that? Yeah, defense has always dictated my um, offense. If I'm very focused on defense, I know I'll have a good game. Um, so I really try to pay attention to like scout and you know, no personnel, which really helped. Um, so yeah, it just dictated everything. So coach, kind of a weird box score here. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> <laughs> okay, what you got? So I never thought you'd beat the number eleven team in the nation and only turn them over four times. Mm -hmm. So that was yeah. that was pretty, uh, I would say, surprising. Mm -hmm. Can you talk a little bit of, a little bit about that? I mean, mm -hmm. and you out rebounded them 30, 25 to thirty one. Mm -hmm. Never. Go ahead. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah. No. I mean, NC State is a very uh, you know just solid basketball team in terms of on the offensive and defensive ends. They're they're very 
uh, you know, poise. They know what they're looking for. They're, you know, they're, they're experienced players. They're good players. So um, we had, we knew like our goal wasn't to turn them over. It was to play solid defense, force a tough shot and finish the play with a rebound. Um, and I thought that was exactly what we did. They, we, we forced them to miss shots and then we came up with it and, and they have people crashing the boards all the time. But that was a big point of emphasis for us um, just to finish the play. And we did that with 38 defensive rebounds. So, um, you know, that, that is what not, you know, turning us, turning them over is one thing, but getting that defensive rebound and getting out in transition, um, is huge for us. We convert so well on that in transition. Um, and so that, that's what you saw tonight. Sarah, I'm sure you know kind of what NC State's accomplished over the last few few years, and obviously the, the number next to their name. How important was it for y'all to come out and make a statement tonight? Um, I feel like we've made a statement this whole season. Like, um, a very mature team who loves each other, and as much as we want to be like, oh, everybody's sleeping on us, we don't have that mentality at all. We approach every game the same, do our scouting report, and go out there and play. And this is usually the end result. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Anything else?